नमस्कार वेलकम टू कॉन्वर्जेशन विथ राकेश दिस वीक आई गोन टेक अप अ क्वेश्चन दैट केम इन वन ऑफ माई क्लासेज दैट वी वर डूइंग विद अ ग्रुप ऑफ मैनेजर्स फ्रॉम अ कॉपरेट वर्ल्ड वी वर डिस्कसिंग अ केस विच वॉज अबाउट कॉन्फ्लिक्ट मैनेजमेंट यूजिंग कम्युनिकेशन फॉर कोलेब्रेशन एंड बींग असर्टिव and the case went very well everybody was talking but there was this one learner a manager who said that rakesh i am comfortable in managing conflicts communication i can be assertive but i have another problem and the problem is that there are times the conversation with my teams is not a conflict or not about assertiveness it's a very strange situation like for example uh there is a employee or a person reporting to me who's not doing his work properly he's slacking off he's been a good worker off late there has been some issues and he's slacking off and you know it's very uncomfortable for me to go and tell him to pull his socks up how do i do that and the question actually that he asked me was was a very nice question that why am i so uncomfortable having in having these difficult conversations and how do i have uh difficult conversations this is what we are going to focus on in today's video i think i researched about this i read a few articles and dug up a few videos i reflected on my own life and also spoke to my colleagues about this we have many scenarios every day which are very uncomfortable it could be a neighbor also you know the neighbor just parks his car like 2 inches close to your car and because of that you know you can't open the door properly a very strange phenomena and you just have to call the neighbor and say hey dude please park your car properly but you're very uncomfortable about it same thing you are a big manager you just have to tell somebody in your team ki yaar please come on time please do your work properly there are these issues in your emails and in your reports and in your code or in your whatever output but you're very uncomfortable about it you can probably do better conflict management and negotiation but this you get very uncomfortable now there's a reason for it and after spending few days researching on this and reflecting on my own life i have three big issues that i'd like to talk about and then demystify them and then i'll give you some suggestions now i reflected on my own life that am i very uncomfortable when i have these difficult conversations and the answer is yes now why am i uncomfortable and there are three buckets three reasons which could cause discomfort bucket number 1 is that perhaps i am a people pleaser and people pleasers suffer from low self esteem and confidence bachpan se hi humko sikhaya jata hai ki bhai dusron ko naraz mat kar you know teacher bura manega friend bura manega papa mummy bura manenge society bura maan jayegi so do what they want you to do it is kind of a social conditioning that we are going through and it it does impact us self esteem self confidence also takes a beating we start living for others not for ourselves and because of that we sometimes don't have difficult conversations because we feel ki this is not a people pleasing situation it might be a people displeasing situation so we get very uncomfortable so that could be issue number 1 issue number 2 is that perhaps you could be very sensitive like i am very sensitive to the feelings of others when i travel and i probably look at a full bus i sometimes don't even sit kiar let somebody else sit i am okay i can stand i am very sensitive now i'm not saying i am super duper philanthropic and i'm god's gift to mankind don't get me wrong i'm just sensitive to others i might help them even if they don't need it but i i think a lot about others ki yaar kyun bicharon ko pareshan karna why don't i just be in one place and live my life and let the others do what they have to do so i become very sensitive to their issues and i sacrifice my own issues that i am tired i need a seat but i'm sensitive to others ki theek hai aap le lo yaar no problem that could be a big issue that we are very sensitive in fact many of us use this feeling in a exactly the opposite way ki yaar i'm not thick skinned कुछ भी होता है मुझे बुरा लग जाता है सो आई एम वेरी थिन स्किन एंड थिन स्किन इज अ वेरी बैड वर्ड विच वी डोंट से टू आर सेल्स बट दिस इज अ बिग प्रॉब्लम फॉर मैनेजर्स एंड मेनी ऑफ अस वी डो नॉट हैव द स्किन दैट प्रोटेक्ट अस तो कुछ भी होता है वी फील बैड एंड वी डोंट लाइक इट 
So perhaps you could have this problem that you may not have thick skinned. And the last is many of us, including me, because of some childhood experience of bullying and some fight that we got beaten up, we might be very non-confrontational. We might be peace loving. I'll sit in my living room with a book and I'll stay away from all this jig jig. A lot of us are like that. And uh, it could be a fight, a bully in the childhood, which we haven't dealt with properly. So what happens is we kind of close ourselves as a personality. And we don't end up in a situation which leads to a conflict or a tough situation where we have to have an uncomfortable conversation. And that could cause this discomfort. So let me summarize the three issues that you may have. One, you may be a person who is very people-pleasing because of low self-esteem and confidence. It could be a power issue also. Ki boss ko pleasy karna padega, toh, you may have a very dis discomforting situation there, right? And we talked about assertiveness. But leave assertiveness out of it. You could be a person who by nature of upbringing, social conditioning, could be a people-pleaser and could be because of low self-esteem. So please think about it. Number two, you could be a very sensitive human being who probably doesn't want to uh, give inconvenience to others. You're not thick-skinned. You're a person who would rather, if there is a table with 10 cakes and there are 20 people, you'll say, Ki yaar, aap I'll, I'll probably not take it. Because, you know, why put you in inconvenience? So you're that kind of a person. And the third is that perhaps you are a non-confrontational person because of some issue in childhood. You don't like fights. And you probably are a peace-loving soul that you want to be in one corner. But now with these things, I want to also let you know that, see, you are in a karam kshetra, you are a manager. A corporate world, a business world, a market world works on very different principles. We have to balance the peace-loving nature, the non-confrontational nature, and the respect for other natures and sensitivity to others to being very, very clear in your management style. There will be times you have to be a tough administrator. And tough administrators have to take tough decisions. Tough decisions have are not fun. Logon ko bura lagta hai. Par agar aap wo manager ho aur aapko lagta hai ki yaar kyun mein logon ko dukh pohunchaun. You are causing harm to yourself. Your role requires you to take tough decisions. But you are uncomfortable having these conversations. Aap apne aap ko hi maar rahe ho. It's like digging your own grave. So for heaven's sake, please reflect on it. Please think about it and change your perspective that I am a manager. I am here to do good for myself, for my team and my company. And these conversations are very important. If I don't tell this person who is slacking, the company will have a big problem. Imagine you are a, running a train and there is somebody slacking on in this duty and the train is going in the wrong direction. And if you are uncomfortable in telling him the train will have a wreck, so think differently. Here I have to drive this train and take it to this right destination. Everybody is important. I have to be an administrator so that we stay on time and stay on course. And if I am uncomfortable, let me first deal with my own mental barriers. And the three mental barriers could be, I could be a people pleaser. I could be an overly sensitive human being. Or I could be a non-confrontational person. So let me deal with that. So please talk to someone. A mentor, a coach, a counselor is a very good person to have a chat that talk about these things. What am I facing? Why am I facing this? What can I do to deal with it? So that's a very good thing you should do. Step number two, tell yourself that I'm not a bad person. I'm doing my job. Administration management is a job. Agar main kisi ko na bolta hu ya feedback deta hu, which is bad for them, I'm doing my job. You know, personally, I'm not a bad person. So tune yourself, disconnect your role to your personality. You have to do your role. And this role is not fun. Ya fir aap resign karke Himalaya pohunch jau. Alright? Don't become managers if you cannot do management jobs better. The problem is many of us want to be managers because... LinkedIn पे लिखना है और society को बनाना है कि मैं बड़ा साहब हूँ। बड़ा साहब बनने के लिए बहुत बड़े-बड़े काम करने पड़ते हैं। And many of these बड़े-बड़े काम are not fun and not easy for others. So please get your mental tuning right. Don't take up jobs that you can't do. And if you are a person who can be a good administrator, tune your mind. And the last is 
prepare yourself for a uncomfortable situation practice it make a script visualize it go stand in front of a mirror have a conversation with yourself go through the process even take feedback from your spouse or a mentor or a well wisher and this is how you kind of create a very nice plan on having uncomfortable discomforting situations so let me summarize find out why you are dealing with this and do something about it uh, make sure you tell yourself that i have to be a good administrator and i have to take these decisions i have to say things which may be very unpleasant but i have to prepare myself and the last is practice script it go through the motion the more you practice the more comfortable you will become to deal with this discomfort that you are going through and once you practice i think you'll do a better job and remember if you do your job well it will benefit you the other person and your organization that's why management positions are so difficult and that's why you have to prepare yourself to do this job better so that you are successful your team is successful and your organization is successful stay safe hi there i hope you are enjoying the videos my team and i are putting together based on the questions you sent us if you like this video do check out the others on the channel and also check out the courses i and my team of experts teach on communication confidence collaboration curiosity creativity and competence on our website sum.education that's s o m e.edu c a t i o n all the details are in the description box below last not least please do like share and subscribe to our videos they really help us i do videos every sunday 5 pm based on your questions so keep them coming and stay tuned